In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to edit videos like this. I'm gonna be doing a voiceover, so the video starts in three, two, one. all shooting and editing on your phone and it's actually super easy and there's a free version so you guys can start making amazing videos for your TikTok, your Instagram, your Twitter, YouTube, whatever you guys want to share these videos. Let's get started with today's tutorial. The first thing you need to understand is where are you gonna upload this video? If you're trying to post it on YouTube, it's best if you record it in a horizontal way. If you're trying to post it on TikTok or Instagram or even Facebook, you could do it the vertical side. It makes it a lot easier for the platform. In this video, I was recording only two or three seconds at a time. I was making it super fast because the more cuts you have before you actually get to the editing room, it's a lot faster. If you're gonna be doing vlogs, try to record yourself talking to the camera 10 seconds at a time to get your point across and it makes it a lot easier when you get to the editing process. That app I'm going to be using for editing is called InShot and InShot is super cool because it's actually free to use. It's going to have a watermark and it's going to give you ads. There's a paid version that takes away the watermark and the ads. That's the one that I currently have. I think it's about $4.99 or $3.99. So we're going to open up InShot and when you open up InShot, you're going to select video. It's going to, it's going to show you your entire library. So when you do this, you select all the videos that you want to use for your shots. So I'm going to pick all these different shots that we had with the Superman is actually 12. When you selected all the videos that you want to edit, you're going to click the green button. Once you click the green button, it's going to load up your stuff. Depending on how big your video is, it's going to take a long time to like process. This one was super fast because all the shots are simple. You're going to see that it's kind of centered in a black bar and that, that's actually tailored for Instagram and I don't want it right now. So what I'm going to go, I'm going to go to the beginning. I'm going to hit canvas and when I hit canvas, it's going to ask you what format do you want? So you here you see no frame. That's just the default. The Instagram, Instagram vertical for the stories or for Instagram TV you're gonna have the YouTube so for this video I'm gonna click on the YouTube link on the YouTube format only that clip is going to be in the YouTube format so in order to do all the clips in the YouTube format you're gonna double click the double check mark right here is gonna say apply to all once you hit apply to all every single clip is gonna be in that YouTube horizontal format I want you to go through every single clip and find a, the best money shot from every the, it could be two seconds it could be one second because every single clip that you record is you're only gonna use a certain footage so remember if you you're doing a vlog yeah of course you want to get your message across you want to get your stuff across I'm gonna be editing every single clip and I'm gonna show you how to do that so for example this video clip right here is a little bit long so you're gonna click on the on the clip it shows it's five seconds long so now you have the option of speed which is gonna make it a lot faster so if you put times two for example it's gonna make the video super fast okay cool that's an option you could put it back to normal I'll put it back to normal for now what you can also do in this video you could rotate so you're gonna rotate the videos if you want it to be upside down, sideways, it just depends on how you shot the film. So right now, I'm gonna keep it the same. You can also flip the, the image. So you see the Superman is on one side, when you click flip, it automatically flips it like if you were to record it from the other side. I've actually used this in a lot of my videos, which is a super cool thing. You could copy the clip and paste it, which creates a copy of the clip, pretty simple. So now we go to trim, and when you go to trim, if you click in this white bar, it's gonna drag where you want it to start. So if I want the video to start right here, the first two seconds of the video are already gone. They're not gonna be able to be used. So I'm gonna click okay and then at the end, maybe I want it to end right there as soon as it crosses the third Superman, the little plus sign, and that's my edit now. You wanna take out the middle part because the middle part you made a pause. So you're gonna go to splits. And when you go to split, it's gonna give you this little red bar. And when you go on this little red bar, what do you want? Okay, so I don't like this little super fast zoom in, so at seven uh, at 2.2 I'm gonna make a cut right here and when you do is you just click that boom it made the cut and it split the clip into two different clips so now I have two different clips of the of the original clip now the next thing you want to do is transition so when you do transitions how fast do you want them it depends on what kind of video you could do one transition at a time which makes your video a lot faster but for the sake of this video I'm gonna make it fast I like using the glitch effects so the glitch it makes do you see that Boom, super quick effect. So I'm gonna add the same transition effect to every single one of these videos. And I'm gonna click the double apply to all. So now every single video has the glitch effect. Now, another thing, I, I kinda wanna mute all these videos. So what I'm gonna do, lower down the volume from this clip. I actually don't want any like noise in the background because I'm gonna be putting a song over it. So I'm gonna show you how to put a song over it in a little bit. Now every single one of my videos is muted. So what I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna go to music. And when you do music, you could do a voiceover. So by doing a recording, okay, it's microphone, and then three, two, one. 
I'm going to be doing a voiceover. So the video starts in three, two, one. Bam. And I'm going to stop it right there. I'm going to be doing a voiceover. So the video starts in three, two, one. Now I'm going to go to tracks. When I go to tracks, you could use any of these songs that are, that, are, that come with this. You could also use iTunes songs, but just remember if you use iTunes songs, some of these songs are going to be copyrighted and you cannot share them on YouTube or Facebook or Instagram. If you're going to share them just for your friends, that's fine, or maybe for TikTok they work. But if you're going to try to make uh, YouTube videos, just be aware that you need to have the rights to use those songs. So for the sake of this video, I'm going to use one of the free songs from whatever this artist is. Insha lets you use these videos. For example, if I use the, the funk. I'm just gonna hit the download and it tells you right here to avoid copyright issues and support the artist we advise you that you add the following to the credits so you just copy music by the funk you just copy and paste that into your YouTube description you paste that into your Instagram description and that way you can use the song starts where I have the marker remember the little white marker okay cool so now it goes over my actual clip so you need to click here and now you need to do the split and it's gonna split the song where the video ends so now I'm gonna delete the second part and now my video is ready. So let's see how it looks right now. I'm going to be doing a voiceover. So the video starts in three, two, one. So the last thing I want to do, maybe I want to add like a like this video or a subscribe. You're going to go to stickers. So when you go to stickers, it actually has a lot of pretty cool effects that you could add to the video. Do the like and then the subscribe. So for sure, hit the subscribe button and you could drag it on and you have it actually, you're able to do this right here. I'll put it on right there and I'm actually going to do a like as well. So like and subscribe, I'll put the like right here and see how that looks. So now let's see how the video looks with the like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Perfect. That's what you want. You want people to like and subscribe to your videos. Speaking of like and subscribe, if you're liking this video so far, like and subscribe. If you haven't already, I will be dropping more editing videos. Maybe every Friday, for sure every Wednesday, there will be a YouTube tutorial for you guys to get started on your YouTube journey. Okay, so the last thing I want to do is maybe you want to add a text. So when you add a text, it's super easy, guys. You just click on text and you write tutorial, tutorial. Boom tutorial and then you could you could mess around with the fonts you guys can mess around with everything so I just click that one for the sake of this video you, you can make it horizontal whatever vertical anywhere you want I'll just I have the video done so what you got to do now is hit that share button on the top right when you click on that it's gonna ask you to save the video and now the saving process does take a little bit of time this one is going quite fast because the video is super short but when you have like a three to ten minute video it takes a long time guys it's actually that's the only like negative about this app is that it takes forever for it to load and you gotta understand that the processing of a phone is different from a processing of a computer so it's gonna run a little bit slower so now the video is saved cool now I go to my photos my video is saved bam I'm gonna be doing a voiceover so the video starts in three two one So there you guys have it, that's my InShot tutorial on how you guys can edit your YouTube videos on your phone. So if I went through something super fast or you have any questions about what's going on, let me know in the comments below guys because I'm definitely here to help you guys start on your YouTube journey. I started, I was using the iMovie app and that one actually sucked. Right now I'm lucky enough to have upgraded to Final Cut Pro. I will be doing some Final Cut Pro tutorials for those people that use Final Cut Pro. And hit me up on Instagram, I will be posting this video on Instagram. If you are watching this video, give me some love on Instagram at warmyafo. Follow me for more updates. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have any suggestions, you can leave them in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Angel, and as always, I'll see you guys next time.